I'm Mrs. Rekha Sen, assistant professor of English, Government First Grade College, Kavu, Mangalore. The session is on the novel Nampali Road by Meena Alexander, prescribed for BBA Fourth Sam of Mangalore University. In the previous session, session four, we saw the rule of uh, Lemka Gauda and uh, his uh, policies where it was uh, very difficult for the orange sellers to survive and uh, they protested under the banner. This was what uh, we saw in the previous session. Continuing the session 4, this is session 5 where you see the people's protest were uh, attacked by ever ready men. Ever ready men, the men of uh, Limka Gauda, who always uh, supported him, who always stood by his side, helping him in his work. People uh, were severely injured when they were attacked by these uh, ever ready men. And the result of this attack, orange cart was smashed within 15 minutes. The road was emptied. The people were hurt. Next day, the orange seller came with a brace on cheek and found rocking the child back and forth on her knees as the cart was smashed. Suddenly, the 10 motorbikes, the ever ready men on their motorbikes, returned with the man in the car whose right hand was loaded with rings, weighed and speeded up the car, which hit the plastic bucket with roses, was shot in the air. He was uh, very violent uh, towards uh, the common people. And uh, he didn't even see what happened behind him. And that car went off. Mira who was uh, returning from the cafe, after returning home, she discussed this issue with uh, Dr. Durga Bai, the mother of Siddharth. Siddharth, he was uh, the friend in England, Dr. Durga Bai Gokale. And this Meera, while uh, living in Hyderabad, she lived with uh, the Durga Bai, who was uh, commonly called as a little mother in the novel. Durga Bhai reminded Meera of the last Independence Day when a man had come with his 11 years old son who had a huge hole on his skull. Meera Bhai was uh, discussing about the incident that happened on uh, the Nampali Road that day, foreign sellers protest. Durga Bhai, she reminds uh, Meera of uh, the past Independence Day where a boy was hurt who had a huge hole on his skull. When Durga Bai inquired regarding this to the child's father, he said that a leopard had mauled the boy three or four weeks ago and he had uh, tried all his best to take the child to a different Vaidyan in the neighboring village. After he failed to get any better treatment from other Vaidyans, he reached Durga Bhai with the little boy in a very worst condition. When they reached Durga Bhai, the boy's condition was uh, uh, severe. And uh, Durga Bhai saw the fat white maggots dipped and crawled in the blood. The infection had spread to the whole head. And uh, she saw the dried blood at the edges of the skull. With this, we come to the end of the session five. If you need any further reading, you can go to the text Compulsory Foundation Course in English 
for the BBABB program, Sam. Thank you, everyone.